think that the HIM faculty here at Pitt has been really helpful, not just with professional or academic advice, but a lot of personal advice as well. Um, they've helped not just me, but my classmates with any projects, any homeworks, any questions that we've had. That The relationship between professors and students here and advisors is really beneficial to the students because there is a very small class size with roughly 30 to 35 students which enables the professors to get to know each one of their students personally which uh, in the end benefits the students whenever they may have issues or even upon graduation looking for jobs. class that we have historically called PC Tools and Database Theory. It's an undergraduate class and students take it the first semester that they come into the HIM program as juniors. This class is being renamed and we're updating a little bit but the, the main focus will remain the same. It teaches students basically how to take data, vast amounts of data, and change it into useful information which is critical in the healthcare environment. So students are introduced to some higher level Excel spreadsheet skills, manipulation of data. Um, we learn about the importance of paying attention to detail, how to format a professional report. Our students benefit from this class in a number of ways. Um, I've been very fortunate over the years to have students email me and say, you know, I really struggled in your class. And I've even had some say, I really hated your class. But I still use Excel and I still use Access. And I would have never used that if we hadn't had to do what we did in your class. One of the classes I enjoyed the most and felt was most beneficial was organizational theory taught by uh, our professor Al Condalusi. In that class we did a lot of fun group activities and learned to work as a team and how to socially interact in the workforce as well as develop socially and emotionally. The course that I really appreciated most within the HIM program was probably the Legal Aspects class because I thought that it introduced students to a lot of statutes and laws that common people and professionals in the healthcare industry aren't aware of. So HIM has changed. It's evolved to be much more based in electronic health records, but uh, electronic everything including the delivery of course material and things like that. Um, the core curriculum has remained fairly constant, as has the basics of the health information management field. Students today find that when they come into HIM, if they're not sure what they want to do, if they're not sure where they would like their career to take them, they have the five semesters in the program to really explore their strengths and what doesn't feel so good as a fit and where they're really strong and, and have an interest and an affinity. student, I realized that I did not want to do as much hands-on work, thus I've decided to try the HIM field, which worked out to my benefit because it turned out to be more of an indirect patient care, and I also found out that it has countless opportunities after graduation to find um, a career of your choice. I chose HIM because I always had an interest in healthcare helping people, science, as well as business. And HIM provides an interesting intersection between business, healthcare, and the IT profession, which I found to be extremely valuable when seeking employment. In the program, we go on four clinical experiences, which two of them are rotational, where you're exposed to various uh, HIM settings and possible job uh, outlooks. However, the two that you're stationed for for six weeks and for an entire semester prove to be very beneficial in terms of networking and ultimately being hired. Myself personally, through my uh, clinical education four class, I will be hopefully obtaining a job at least working throughout the summer.
try to teach in this course is some of the financial and business concepts that they're going to encounter as part of uh, their work in the health information management field. Uh, another important point is, is that there are, there's an enormous amount of money being put into electronic health records right now. And what we try to do in the course is talk about some of the application of dollars and um, the best way for students to be able to evaluate how to spend um, those, those dollars um, in, in their uh, work experience. While being a student in the HIM program, I held a part-time job at Western Psychiatric Institute and Clinic. And I also gained experience from my 90-hour project, which was at the State Correctional Institute. And it made me come to a decision that I would like to hold a job as an electronic health, health record implementation specialist with fo focusing on psych and correctional institutions. I feel like from the experiences that I gained from working at the Psychiatric Institute with meeting people and actually having hands-on experience that I would be able to relate to the um, transition from like a paper record to electronic health record because I could actually understand the day-to-day -day work that they have to go through. Also, we have a lot of different independent projects that students are required to do and, and they're, they're actually required to do these as part of different courses. And I think these are so beneficial for the student to prepare them in their, no matter what career they decide to um, go into. Um, the first one is like a quality management project and that's part of the quality management class. And, we ask them to choose a topic. They have their uh, supervisor um, at, on their clinical site who is actually in charge of, you know, supervises that project, but the student really works on it independently. Also, our students every year um, uh, raise money so that they can go to um, the national convention. And I think next year it will be held in Orlando.